So I have made 50 of these picks. Let's see what we get. If you want to learn how to grind these, it is the most recent video on the channel. Of course, we've got team at the tournament in. The Euros is finished. As we get Cristiano Ronaldo there. The Euros are finished. The Copa America is finished. We all know the results. It is what it is. Congratulations to Spain and Argentina for winners. We get back-to-back -back 86s in the first two picks here. Now, in terms of pack weight, uh, when I did the how to grind, I actually packed a team of the tournament Copper America card. So, you would like to think, in theory, these are going to be good odds. Now, in reality, team of the tournament is one of the harder ones to pack, as I've said that. And that's the actual guy that we packed in the video. So, if you didn't want to know, I've already told you. So, that's why it's not duplicate, because I put him into something. But they seem to be paying out the lower tier cards, shall we say. In terms of the top tier ones... I haven't really seen them in my Discord or there's another walk out there or anything in general. But that could be because a lot of us have just sort of not stopped playing the game now, but kind of switched off. I'm not going to take that 84 as a duplicate. I'm going to try not to take any duplicates if I can. I think it's just got to that point in the game now where we're all kind of starting to have enough. Now, footies is coming this Friday. I am away on holiday for five days, so I won't be around at the start of footies. I apologize for you guys waiting for content. I kind of take the summer off a little bit, spend some time with my family and take a breather because when the new game comes out, FC 25, we go full send almost every single day of the year. So that's why I'm taking a little bit of time off. That's all. But so if you guys want to read the content's going to be, that's the reason why Like I will be doing the next couple of days if we get some content. But the first day, so what day is it today? So two, three days from now, I won't be here, basically. So you won't see any content. So I do apologize for that. But at the end of the day, we all need a break. And this game has got to the point now where you play it every single day. You're going to get to a certain point where you just can't go any further with it. I've kind of hit that point now. These Euro cards have been crazy. A lot of 99 and 98 rated cards overall. So it's really hard to improve your team at this time of the year. Which I understand, but I will be back once the holiday is finished. So if you guys are wondering, let me know if you're still playing this a lot or you're sort of playing it less casually now. And, or sorry, more casually, less, more serious. If you understand what I mean, that's absolutely terrible English there. But you get the idea. I'm interested to know if you guys are still playing it or not. Are you pre-ordering the new one? Are you going to wait? I will be covering a video on which version you should buy if you are interested. What's going to help you in the long run? What's the better choice if you only got a small budget for the game? And I will be doing some giveaways, but we'll get into that a little bit closer to the new game coming out around September. So keep your eyes peeled for the channel if you want to see those giveaways. But you see there, these are okay. One special card, a, lot, a few walkouts here and there. Nothing too crazy to shout about. I haven't seen that Neville card in ages. Nothing too crazy to shout about as of yet. As we get ourselves another 82 here. No duplicates when we can. I would like one team of the tournament from the Europe card. I've had the Copper America a couple times now. I've had... Fabian Ruiz, I think that's the only one I had, and that was from like an 85 times 5. So we'll have to see. We are getting a few duplicates here now, if typical. We'll take a Grealish, 85 rated. So we'll have to let me know if you've managed to pack any of these team of the tournaments. I don't know if you guys are still going really hard on grinding the game or not. But yeah, like I said, for me, it kind of like not died off from it now, but it's become a little bit less interested. I've been very obsessed with the Euros as I'm a football fanatic and love football anyway. So that's been great for me. Now it's finished. We are into pre-season and then all the major leagues, etc., come back. So football will be back in full swing before you know it. There's literally no break from football nowadays, which is just crazy to me. When I was a kid, a long, 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 long time ago, we had a massive break in football and now we don't, which is just crazy. So football will be back before you know it. And we'll be getting ready for FC 25. Now that we will be covering so much content on FC 25 on this channel, it's going to help you play for free, help you do other things that you may not know how to do, like, for example, get XP, objectives. There are a couple more things I've got in the works I don't want to say just yet that will be coming as well, which will help you in the long run. So hopefully this is going to be the main place for you guys to go for either, as a nicer duplicate, but like for tutorials or anything like that. And just make sure you don't spend too much money on the game at the end of the day. That's the aim of the channel. That's where we're getting to, as you already know, of course. As the year goes on, the breakdowns and explanations on videos do get a little bit shorter because I end up repeating myself a lot, as I'm sure a lot of you guys know. But at the start, they will be deep dives. We will be running a brand new membership for the channel as well, and I'll get to that a lot day. We don't want to talk about that today. So there's a lot of exciting things coming on the channel in general. We are getting quite a lot of walkouts here. But I will be honest, I don't want to see walkouts anymore. I just want to see special cards. I can't wait for 30s to come in because we're going to get back all of the old cards. So like every other pick's normally like a special card, essentially. That's way more fun than getting 85, 86, 87, 88, and 89 golds. As we get two 86s there, Portugal and an English. We've got three left on this page. And let me know if you're going to be grinding these or not in terms of player picks or you're going to go for the 80 plus times three. I don't think the 80 plus times three is worth it. 
Especially where we only need to have eight cards in the picks to get that done. It's way easier to grind, way quicker. Let's get another 88 there. How many have we got left? Not many. Okay, it's our last one, so there you go. And our last pick here is going to be an 85 Trippier. I'm going to go ahead and do the 86 player pick, so I'll be back once that's done. So both of the 86 doubles have been uh, completed there. I've got some of the duplicates back in. I completed one for how to grind, so let's see what we get out of these. No special card out of these. I didn't get one out of the first one either. So the last one to get a special card or not, let's see. As we do... And it's Calafiore who's apparently joining Arsenal. Let me know what you got. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.